to another YouTube video. So today I'll be remaking my paper squishies. I'm starting today and the squishy I'm remaking is this Junior Mint squishy. It's not even that squishy and I really want to remake it. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. If you want to follow along, all you need is stuffing, scissors, tape, and any coloring supplies. So let's get started. I need a pencil subscribe and give this video a huge thumbs up and let's get started well anyways um i had already drawn out the template for the 3d squishy so i was just sketching out the letters it was a little easy the hardest letter had to be n but either way the rest of the letters were really easy and i feel like the o really brought it together um for some reason and then i was just writing mints and then i had to draw the little actual mint which were pretty easy, they're just little ovals. Finished the sketch, by the way, I am using like a different 3D thing, so that's why I have like extra ones. So this one, I'm gonna cut out separately, and I'm gonna add to here, and this one I'm gonna do the same, but add it to this corner, so then it can be 3D. Also, I kinda like the sketch a lot, um, but yeah, and then I'm, these are the little chocolate things. So right here it says creamy mints and pure chocolate. So I'm going to write that at the end. Um, and then I might do the little thing. But yeah, now I'm going to color it. Um, honestly how it came out but I'm still gonna work with it and then all I'm gonna do now is like with something dark I'm gonna just kind of outline it so I'm actually gonna do it with my pencil I'm just gonna outline the little cream part so they know that that creamy stuff is coming out and then also I'm gonna do another one because it looks really lonely and then um, I'm just gonna add in the creamy stuff too so it should look like that and so in case you guys want to know how I made this I just added um, the shape for the 3d thing I just made a rectangle and then added two thinner rectangles on um, on one side and then it on the other side so it's pretty much in the corner of the paper um, but yeah now I'm gonna laminate it with the tape and then I'm gonna cut it out this was just me laminating it with the tape um it was pretty easy um this was actually a brand new roll of tape just in case you wanted to know i don't know if you did but so now you should pretty much have something like this so you have your two rectangle your two small rectangles and then two other smaller rectangles and then your thing so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut off one of them so you now have just one and you have that one off and then you're gonna do that to both of them next you're gonna get a piece of tape and then on the other side you're gonna put that piece of tape like that and then you're gonna flip it over and then you're just gonna add your piece on i'm also gonna do that to the other side so now you should have a side on each side and then you're just pretty much just gonna fold them over that. and then you're gonna need to cut out another one of these so once you so once you have a piece that's laminated it should be the same size as your thing I'm gonna put oh, it I do want to let you guys know that I did end up and tracing the template also, onto a, uh, um, a different piece of paper because it wasn't because big enough, so that's what you should definitely do, and then just put it together. Okay, well anyways, this is the final result, so this is... The actual one I just made. It's pretty slow rising. I actually kind of like it. I just wish I could have put more detail into the little mint things. Um, but this was the first one. And then this was the second one. So, I mean, they pretty much look the same to me. 
But, I mean, I feel like these, like, I feel like this was really cool. Yeah, this is the final result. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. And turn on the bell notification so you know every time I post a new video, I will be posting lots more soon. Anyways, that's it, and I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!